Welcome to Sketchy's Killer Robot Factory. In the next three minutes, we're gonna show you how the Sketchy method works and how we sear information into your brain so that it lives there forever. By placing objects, or symbols, around this robot factory, we'll create a scene to help you quickly recall all the high-yield information you need to remember. Today's topic? Botulism. At Sketchy, we symbolize botulism with a tin can robot just like Timmy, the tin can bot here. Bot obviously reminds you of botulism, but why a tin can? Well, that's because improperly canned food is a super important risk factor for botulism. You'll also notice that this sketch has a lot of purple hues. That's because this organism turns purple with gram stain, so it's a gram-positive organism. We use environmental clues like this to enhance your memory. When you close your eyes and think about this sketch, you'll remember that purple tone, and from there, it's easy to remember that it's gram-positive. We also love to exploit the power of recurring symbols. Botulism is an anaerobic bacterium, so we'll add this anaerobic gas mask here. But it's also all over sketchy. Anytime we talk about an anaerobic bacterium, you'll see this gas mask. Now that we've covered some key identifying features of botulism, let's talk about what makes it so dangerous. Botox, baby. Botulinum toxin is a special protease that interferes with the ability of your nerve cells to send messages, essentially cutting them off from the rest of your body. See how this mad scientist is cleaving the wires with her protease scissors and shutting down that Tesla coil? Similarly, Botox cleaves the snare proteins that are necessary for exocytosis of neurotransmitters at the presynaptic nerve terminal. If all that sounds bad, that's because it is. Blocking those neurotransmitters results in a characteristic descending paralysis. As a result of the mad scientist snipping that wire, the robot shut down. Specifically, it powered off from head to toe, which is what we mean by descending paralysis. Poor Timmy. Can you even be a killer robot if you don't even get to do one murder? <sighs> and that's it. That's our sketch. Over the next couple days, while you're flossing or scrolling your socials or, you know, obsessively checking your canned goods, this scene will burst into your brain and you'll realize you know more about botulism than you did three minutes ago. You know, it looks like these robots are not happy about what happened to Tin Can Timmy. I don't know how we're going to get out of here, uh, unless one of you knows how to do the robot?